Hey, is it possible to play Fallout 3 without having to go through the, the Windows Live whole crap? Oh, no. Unfortunately, uh, Fallout 3 was kind of tied to that. Yeah. Uh, thankfully, they were able to get New Vegas to not be tied to that, which is making New Vegas so much better. Hello, patrons of Gaming Wildlife. This is your director. Uh, Alex, you remember him from the past few days of playing... Uh, Rocket League. Rocket League. And now we are going to complete the... Hel we. I'm going to complete the Helios 1 quest in New Vegas. See, like, my favorite thing in the Fallout franchise is always com computer hacking. Because I, I, like, once you understand the mechanics behind it, it's just, like, really fun. Huh. Do you, I mean... I, I do, yeah. I, I'm actually, as you can see for this character, I've been doing a lot of science stuff. Oh. oh well, even with a low know. science score, I mean... So, yeah. uh, do you know how to do, like, uh, hacks in the computer? Yep, I know how to eliminate stuff. Okay, obviously. Oh. Hi. How you doing? I'm, I'm right here. I'm right here. I, I don't know, like, okay. You're right. You should not have done that. Oh. See, they're all to your left. Hmm. I'll be alright. There's stuff in here. Uh, might not need it. There he is. Alright. Shoot him. I'll be alright. I've got a high, uh... Oh, man. So many of them. Holy shit! Okay. Grenade. The, uh, frag grenade, yep. Throw! Use your vats and And explosion. I am not doing so well. Uh, doctor's bag, stim pack. I don't think I'm being chased anymore. Okay, so, um, laser rifle. I told you about laser rifles, right? Yes, you did. And I'm ignoring that for now because I'm inside and I'm probably not going to come back here. Well, the game's still going to have to remember it. Hmm. And those piles, the uh, disintegration piles don't have to go away. Hi. How you doing, runaway? <laughs> come here. But I think if you use it against robots, it doesn't count. Hmm. I mean, well, I mean, it's only if I get a critical... I heard it was just a every electric. You're not fun, okay? You're just not. Boom! Explosion! Anyone else? Didn't think so. What? Because I know in the first game you were able to convert scrap metal into like uh, you were able to like turn it in for a bunch of karma and ten caps. But can you do anything like that in I this have game? No idea. Like I said, I have barely played New Vegas. Hmm. Hell, I barely played Fallout Three. I'm more of an Elder Scrolls guy. Eh. I really liked Fallout Three. It was fun. Took all the food. Alright, well, I guess this is... Yeah, okay. To the observation level. Okay, I'm going to record two separate videos here, because one of them... Uh, so I'm going to save right now. One of them I'm going to blow up the whole place, because it's just fun to watch. Uh, and this one I'm just... I'm going to do the quest as I would normally do. Currently I'm responsive. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, I need to restore power. Okay. So how do I do... Look, it's a block. Wee. Oh. <laughs> Look, it's a mug. Wee. <laughs> Empty. Ooh, something in here. Nuka Cola, sweet. Whiskey. Wee. <laughs> I don't know why I keep doing this. Oh, fridge. Actually, good things in the fridge, usually. Uh, okay, I gotta go up here. Anyone up here? Still hidden. Hello? 
Oh, that's right. I gotta... That's right. I've got options I have to do. I've got options I have to do. Okay. Uh, Protectron, Mr. Gun... Ooh, Python. Ooh. Hardware the robot to run on autopilot and repair mode. Yeah, let's do it. Python. Uh, one of my science skills. What are you doing? What you gonna do? What are you doing? Come back here. Where you going? Well, he's not hostile, but... Oh, is he gonna repair this? No, he's just gonna... Uh, uh, oh. Oh, that's right. I had to do this. He's just gonna repair it. Huh. The robot has been fitted with a variety of tools, especially. There's nothing left in the room for it to repair. Cool! That works! <laughs> Good for me. Good enough for me. <laughs> Alright. That's right. Okay. Now I'm going to quick save. So I can do that one part where I just blow everything up for the hell of it. Alright. Um. Configure power grid. Okay, so they specifically asked me to do McCarran and the Vegas Strip. If I do that, NCR is going to like me. Um, if I do full region, everyone gets a little bit of power, but it's not great. Uh, if I do full region... Oh, no, wait. Emergency output level will overload the system. Full region, everyone gets a little bit of power, but it's not that great. Fremont and West Side, uh, the um, followers of the Apocalypse like me. And McCarran in the Vegas Strip, uh, NCR likes me. Since I'm doing the Great Doctor and the Great Doctor has to go with NCR, I'm going to pick that. Uh, Arm Archimedes Plant Defense System. Okay. Initiate reflector targeting from the console on the observation deck. Let's go do that. But yeah, you can test Archimedes, which is the... Uh, which is the big, essentially a nuclear bomb kind of thing. Hmm, pinion nuts. Let's go outside. Just curious, why are you running in windows, man? Um, so that... Good. Uh, so that uh, it's a lot easier for, for me to make sure that the... I'm doing it in windowed mode so that the recording doesn't have any problems with it. I've had problems with it if I don't run it in windowed mode. I think, do I go? No, I go down. Okay. Yeah, here we are. Lower level. How much time do I have? Eh, a little bit of time. Yeah, about 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. And activate. Console's unresponsive. Fine, I'll wait until 9 a.m. Jesus um, my Christ. My fiance, uh, I bought um, Oblivion for her on Steam. Mm -hmm. And she didn't read through like the instructions or anything. Yep. And she didn't know about the rest and wait button. Mm -hmm. So she literally was sitting outside of a shop for like 20 minutes before it would open. Well, you can only like you can only do it at hours at a time for like Fallout. Well, Here we go, 9 a.m. Activate. Initiate reflector. Talk to Fantastic. Fantastic. It's gonna get me some money and some reputation for the NCR. How dare you jump? <laughs> <laughs> ah, so blind and bright. Can't see. There we go. Yay, it's working! Now, if I wanted to, I could have blown up this entire area. <laughs> See, that was one of my favorite parts of Fallout 3, is Nuke and Megaton. Uh, like, yeah. I usually play good characters, but the one time I chose to do a bad character, just seeing it go from Tenpenny Tower was just like... Tunnel snakes. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! No! Swear to God! <laughs> swear to me. <laughs> the phone's just like, swear to me! <laughs> uh, I can still do Archimedes, really? I'll do that I'll do that in the other episode. <laughs> nope. Alright. 
Now I gotta get back out of here, walk all the way down to a stupid piece of... Hmm. Is my lockpick skill high enough? I don't think I... Yeah, I'm not putting anything in the lockpick. Fine, I won't do it. It was a lot more useful in the in uh, Fallout 3 than it is in New Vegas, anyway. Walking. It's a lot more useful in fucking Elder Scrolls than anything. Yeah, it, well, I mean, like, you don't have hacking in Elder Scrolls. <laughs> Do you? Well, not exactly yeah. hacking, but... Hi, Warhammer, stop! Please stop. Just, just stop. He keeps, like... Warhammer is one uh, a guy who watches our Let's Play channel, and he is awesome for doing that. I'm just like he keeps interrupting me during the game. <laughs> Please stop doing that. I want to play my game. Anyone out here? Yeah, maybe not. I don't know, but like in Moral in the magic system, like Vegas, you could fucking fly mm -hmm. everywhere. Go. Back before they made towns, like, isolated, you know, so that you had to load to go into the town. Yeah. I, God, I've, because I vaguely remember playing an older Elder Scrolls, but, like, the first one, I want to say. Yeah. I remember playing, uh, it was a 3D game, but I remember playing it a long time ago. Well, there was Arena, and then there was Daggerfall, which right. was the second one. Daggerfall was, like, more 3D, quote-unquote. Right. Um, I'm stuck. It it was it's considered one of the biggest games of all time. Well, it actually is considered the biggest game of all time, mm. save for uh, Minecraft, of course. But yeah. um, it is essentially, if you were to run across the map, it would be like you're actually running across the actual distance of Great Britain. Yep. Okay, I'm going down here. Talk to this guy. I didn't help the followers of the apocalypse. I'm sorry. Deal with it. Uh, nothing. Alright, fantastic. I did your thing. Yo. Yo. Uh, sent power to McCarran in the strip? Whoa, really? Oh, shit. Oh, I knew I could do it. Those NCR pricks can all get on their knees and worship at the altar of fucking fantastic. Language. Don't worry. I'll tell them what you did for me, man. Not all of it, though. They think I was an idiot. But some of it. Keep at it, man. One day you could end up where I am. Uh huh. You never know. So, bye. Adios, amigo. He's kind of a prick. Alright, level 7. What do I level up? I, I need to put stuff in medicine and science. Because those are the two I need to adhere to for the character. Uh, but I can probably put some more stuff in other places. You need to put some into your battle mechanics. So, like, guns. Mm, I can put a couple into guns. Or, I mean, if you're really into that laser weapon, energy weapons. I'm not that into the laser Plus, weapon. that's really low. Yeah, that is really fine. I'll do. Fine. No, I I'm just saying for fucking forget it. Oh, okay. Well, then I won't do energy weapons. I don't know. Um, barter's uh, always good. Yeah, I've been doing I've been doing a lot in barter. That feels like that should be the Speech. third. Speech. Speech. Speech is very important. Yeah. And then I'll put five into science. Jesus, that's a seventy science for. Yep. I'm gonna steal your food. Deal with it. <laughs> Uh, up here. Alright, do I talk to the lady at the front? Have I completed the quest? Do I... I think it's already completed. Yep. So those three are the expansion pack. That is one I'll have to do later. Okay, I need to apparently complete this quest because I didn't for some reason last time. I thought I had. So anyway, open the door. Get on the floor. Everybody walk the dinosaur. I'm gonna shoot you in the fin. No, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> Open the door, get down on the floor. Everybody walk the dinosaur. That Am truly I? tests, you know, the age. No. It's very easy, dude. Mm -hmm. You can do it. Not that hard. Uh. <laughs> I lost karma for doing that. What? Yeah. That's why I didn't want to do it, because I lost karma. That's a load of horse shit. Well, it's the side door. They don't want you going through the side door. Finish your quest! What is it? Uh, everything's done. Okay, fine. You, you don't care. You don't care. Fine. Whatever. No. No, it's fine! <laughs> Make a save. 
<laughs> uh, so that's Repcon. Seven out of one thousand saves. Yeah, I, well, that's that's the beauty about having a PC yeah, version. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I am a PC gamer too. I know, but do you have a tower as good as mine? <laughs> I used to. I'm traveling to Novak. After I get Rocket Band Four and maybe uh, Metal Gear Solid Five, then I'll probably start saving up for a tower. So the there you go. All right, so who do I... Oh, yeah, Manny Vargas. I need to talk to him. Oh, I never completed... Wait, didn't... Oh, yeah, no, I never completed that quest, I guess. There's a big dinosaur. Yep. Door inside. That's right. I didn't really complete that quest where I told him, Hey, buddy, guess what? I got rid of all the mutants. Do you have any luck with the ghouls? Yeah, they're, they're gone. Really? Unbelievable, man. I knew that wasn't going to be easy. Mm-hmm. I have. Now, about the man I'm looking for. Okay, I'll tell you everything I know, like I promised. Good. The guy you're looking for, Benny. Benny. He's traveling with some members from my old gang. They were going to Boulder City. Hmm. Where is Boulder City? It's straight up Route 93 from here. Just keep following the road north. Mm -hmm. Any idea why they went that way? No clue. I know Benny hadn't paid up yet. Maybe that was where they were supposed to get square. Uh huh. That's all I need to know. Hope that helps. Uh, that's it. Alright. Now I know where Benny's going. Continue the quest! Oh yeah, I stole a bunch of stuff from him. <laughs> and then sold it back to him. <laughs> because that... Classic. I know I know I'm supposed to be playing a good guy in this game, but that's what you do in New Vegas. That's what you do in any of these games. Alright, moving on. Benny said he went that way. I'm going to switch back to my 9mm. Which is, I think, much better than the... Pistol I've got. You need ammo. I do need ammo. I'm. I don't have a lot of it. Is there a store nearby? Is that the guy you just robbed? Um. Yeah. I'll. I'll go to the store in the next area. There's. Sure they do. Sure they do. Heading out north. Heading to New Vegas. I'll hopefully make it to New Vegas before episode like twenty or something. I think this one's episode twelve. I've already gotten 12 through, uh, through 12 episodes of New Vegas, and I haven't even made it there yet. Really? Yeah. Is it really that far away, or have you just been dicking around? Well, I've been, like, I've been side-questing. Uh, I did a series of side-quests where I went to the Repcon Center. I helped Boone kill the guy who killed his wife, or killed the lady who killed his wife. I went to Helios 1, did all that stuff, and now I'm just heading out to New Vegas. I will eventually make it there, and I'm going to need like 2,000 caps to get in, which is going to be expensive as hell. Eventually, but yeah, according to this, uh, to the character I rolled up, I need to get Rex on my side, the uh, little dog. Mm -hmm. Where? Am I heading in the right direction? Yeah, I'm heading in the right direction. He said follow the road. Yeah. Follow the yellow brick road. Follow the... Okay, this one goes to Helios, so I'm going to need to follow this road. Oh. Okay. I thought that was... By the way, combat is about to start noise. <laughs> hmm. well, I am going to encounter some, like, ruffians and stuff along the way. Some raiders, mostly. Raiders. Fucking raiders, man. Oh, that's a... Oh, that's a caravan. They're shooting stuff. Oh, God, people are trying to take down the caravan. You don't have nearly enough bullets, man. Mm. You're having a lot of pop-up, too. A lot of pop up? What do you mean? On the left side. Ooh. Dude, not Vi from that far away. Viper. Hmm. He sees me. Uh, get out of sneak mode then. Come on. Come on. Do you have a rifle? Uh, actually, yeah, I could probably switch up weapons. Uh, machete, repeater. Uh, cowboy repeater, I got a lot of ammo on. Use it. Come on. Come on, what you got? That's now. Head. And he is dead. He is a dead man. Good thing too. I'm gonna take all your stuff. Have fun with that. Uh, I need to not die. So let's get me some ramen steak. One of those. Squirrel bits. Dirty water. You're only 
health. Uh, it's unfortunately Vegas does damage over time for health, and it's really stupid. But yeah, that's the way it is. What do you mean? Like, look, my health oh, in the that's corner. Stupid yeah. Shit. That's one bad thing about the industry lately is just how they're dumbing down everything for kids these days. Like, have you, have you played the Super Mario games for, you know, the 3DS? Like, Mario 3D World? Um, no. Well, or, yeah, If, if you a die, bit. it's like a certain amount of times, so they'll give you this power-up at the beginning of the level that makes you invincible, and you can just run through it. Kids these days have no idea what difficult actually means. Kids these days, am I right? Me. Hey, that was, <laughs> that was coincidentally the first video I did with you guys. Yeah. Back in my day, we didn't have things like checkpoints and safety. <laughs> but then the 90s... No! <laughs> <laughs> I remember that. That was a fun episode. I, I rewatched that the other day, and the the powder flying off of my hair, it was... It was it's so beautiful. <laughs> It actually looked like you punched the dust out of me. Pokemon, if I keep saying Pokemon, will you start crying? <laughs> the joke's on him. I poisoned that balloon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, John, John has such a... Ooh, the Eldorado, Eldorado Gas, Gas and service. service. There's probably nothing in here, but I may as well investigate. There was probably a new... Turn your Gun cabinet. Hey! Take him. Stuff. Cash register. Take Ooh! Him. Lots of stuff. Stuff to steal, stuff to take. Sun says Asperilla! Mine. Sack. Blamco mac and cheese. Yep. Dandy boy apples. Which somehow have survived a nuclear apocalypse. And have stayed in the bag for God only knows how many years. Yep. And some yeast. Still ripe and fresh. I'm just gonna take everything. Cram. Dirty water. Empty sunset sarsaparilla. Fuck it. I don't need that. Box empty. Sunset sarsaparilla. These are still good for some reason. Actually, the thing about New Vegas, despite the. Okay. thought I heard someone shoot at me. Well, the thing about New Vegas is, despite the fact that, yeah, a lot of this looks like it was ravaged by nuclear apocalypse, Vegas was never hit by a bomb. This is I'm guessing this is all just wear and tear and stuff, but it's in a significantly better, like, condition than it was for... Yeah, Washington, yeah. Oh, yeah, like, much better than Washington. Where am I going? Oh, there's a side road that I could take. Fuck it, I'm not taking the side road. I'm going to walk straight, straight through. Oh man, see, do you see all the pop up you're getting? Do what? The pop up. You're getting a shit ton of pop up. For what? Okay, get to the top of the hill. Uh huh. And then start watching and look in the distance, and you'll see a shit ton of things popping up. You need to set your di yeah, your uh, graphical levels a bit more. Higher, lower? High, higher, obviously. Oh. See, off to the left. Just keep walking straight and look off to the left. You'll see shit pop up. Oh. Which, if your rig is as powerful as you say it is, you can up the graphical quality. Ah! Ah, rats for me. Um, dude, you're gonna want to fucking Fine. the shit out of it. And maybe use a melee weapon. Uh, go for it. No, stinger, stinger, stinger. Because it does more damage? You take out the stinger. You can't He's flying! <laughs> Oh, there's oh, more of them. Shit. Uh, I need something a little more powerful. Melee. Fine, go with a machete. Come here. Come here. I'ma get you. I'ma get you. I'ma get you. This is rolling. There you go. They're dead. I still, I'm still under attack. By who? By what? What's attacking me? I don't see anything. Yeah, he's, he's making his way over. Come on. Come here. Come here. It's the first time I was playing Morrowind. <laughs> there was a mud crab chasing me for like 
30 miles. <laughs> I was trying, I was going from Say to Neen to Balmore for the first time. And <laughs> this damn mud crab followed me for half of the journey. The journey. Could you not kill it or? Ah! No, I didn't, I didn't realize where it was. I couldn't find it. Because it didn't, you know, um, Morrowind didn't have, like, you know, a that system that would point out enemies. And the mud crab kind of, like, blended it. Blended in with the environment. And then all of a sudden you just start taking damage. It's like, what the hell's going on here? Oh, I'm taking damage from a mud crab. Boulder City. Oh, yeah, this is the place where there's like... Okay, birds. This is the place where there's going to be like a shootout and I have to... I can, I don't have to, but I'll help out these guys because I think they're in CR. Probably make for a more fun game if I actually didn't help them out at every turn. We've got a situation with some great cons right now. The brass and the Karen has ordered me to lock down the ruins until it's been resolved. Okay. What's going on? One of my patrols was on its way back from Novak when it came under fire from the great cons. Mm -hmm. They radioed for reinforcements, but instead of waiting for us, they chased the cons into the ruins where they were called in a crossfire. Mm -hmm. No deaths, but not all the squad got out. The cons have private Ackerman and private Gilbert as hostages. Yeah. These, oh well. Uh, Adios, patrons of the. Well, I mean, we, we may as well just like call the episode here. We can probably just do that. So, uh, everyone, if you don't, uh, hi Warhammer. Yes, <laughs> Warhammer. I appreciate that you love the channel, and I think that's cool and all. But would you mind not contacting me like in the middle of an episode? That'd be great. Uh, so, everyone, thank you for watching. Uh, please leave a like, comment, subscribe. We'll see you next time when Game Wildlife plays.